It's now time for us to find out has Rick got the X Factor. <laughs> Okay, oh God, folks, we are ready, and just like last week, we have our judges. We have Andy here as Louis Walsh. He is? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I mean, like, yeah, he. I actually have to do a Louis Walsh accent. Louis Walsh. Hey, hey guys! Hey. Hey. hey, everything is great and wonderful in the world. How are you today, Lisa? Steal my line, I'll you next time. How resident. are you, Ricky, today? Lisa is our resident, Danny Minogue. Oh, God, her again. And on the line, we have our resident, Simon Cowell. Saturday Sound Boys, Daniel Pitcher. Good evening, lads. Hey. And Simon Cowell, it feels like I'm in the audience. Oh, my God! Okay, folks, well, <laughs> it was a real struggle. Andy, you were in the studio with me earlier on today. A uh, real struggle. <laughs> they wouldn't the X Factor, you have to have you have to have your hard times and you have to have your challenges and you have to overcome them. But you set the standards pretty high to try and achieve this week. Yeah, so folks, please don't judge me if these are all terrible, okay? <laughs> today we have our selection of power ballads. Power ballads indeed. My favourite. <laughs> I do like a good power ballad. I mean, well, I, I had a power ballad once. I did. Yeah. Uh, this, is all, this is all freaking me out here. <laughs> you know, I, I was about to say, if I listen to this with my eyes closed, I'd actually get scared, but I just realised we're on the radio! <laughs> Live and kicking! I think it's time for us to find out the very first song. Uh oh. Well, folks, right, give us your thoughts on this, of course. You can vote on the Bebo after the three songs have been played. This first one is a number by the commitments, and it is Try a Little Tenderness. Can I vote? Of course you can, why not? It's people.com slash anger management one. There you go, have that title log on your votes. Right, try a little ten in this, folks. Enjoy. Oh, she may be weary. And young girls, they do get weary. Well, in that same old shaggy dress. But when she gets weary. Try a little tenderness. It's not just sentimental, no, no. She has a grief and her care. Yeah, 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 yeah. But the soft words, they are spoke so gentle. That makes it easier, easier to bear, yeah. You won't regret it, no, no. Young girls, they never forget it. Love is their only happiness. But it is all so easy. All you gotta do is try your little tenderness, yeah. And squeeze her, don't you tease her, never leave her. You got to, you got to, you got to, you got to try your little tenderness, yeah. Oh, baby, you gotta squeeze her, don't you tease, baby, no. You got to, got to, got to, got to. Try a little tenderness. Whoa, yeah, yeah. Go on, lay it on me. You got real into that song, didn't you? Wow, <laughs> that was really enthusiastic, go anyway. Bad. Yeah, go on, Simon Otto. Um, well, personally, I do think that uh, Anto, the taxi driver, has more of a chance of pulling uh, Lisa there in the studio than you have getting. Oh my god! Oh, oh. that chance! <laughs> Hang on, who's he slagging there? Me. Everyone. Oh, I thought I thought I had a chance. Uh, no. Oh. Um, no. In the voice of the voice, no. But back to Danny. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all, no. No, no, I don't hear a chance at all. Go on, judges. There's a knockabout. Thoughts, judges. 
Well, I really liked it because it was really enthusiastic, and uh, uh, if you're a star, then you have to be enthusiastic. Oh, come on, Danny. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well I, I, had a, I had a hit record once, it got to like the top ten. And That's everything. a good point. If Danny Minogue has had a hit record, I might just have a hope. Oh. Anybody can have a top record if Danny Minogue had it, because <laughs> she's so terrible. Yeah. And can I just say, Danny, now, for that, you're moving down, you're moving up one seat now on the table now next year. What? what? Really? Yeah, you're moving away from Simon, I'm saying that's... But, but, uh, but, but I'm so enthusiastic and I'm Australian, <laughs> I'm, I'm exotic. No, it's just like I like sitting beside Cheryl Coe for, you know, obvious reasons. Is it because... Girls allowed. Is it because she's pretty? Or young? Or, or not uh, Botox? Yeah, that's, that's classic, I mean, I've never Botox. You, I'm afraid, Danny. Talented, uh, you also forgot to add is because she's talented or has a real face. <gasps> so, you just signed Charlie out of 10 minutes, we have a comments on it, right? Oh yeah, go on, Louis. I thought it was great! Okay. I just did a Shrek answer to it, I'm I thought it was one. great! <laughs> Fantastic! <laughs> Alright, folks, if you thought that was...